I have recently been humbled by my consistent struggle to solve these little puzzles where the answer is eight. So obviously me and the number eight need to get to know each other a little bit better. But then I thought to myself, how well do any of us really know the number eight? Grab yourself a hot chocolate and get ready for this bedtime reading of things nobody knows about the number eight. Does pi contain more eights than any of the other digits? Well, probably not. The digits probably occur at the same frequency, making pi what is called a normal number. But we have no proof of that. There might be one number which is vastly in the lead. We do not know if all of the digits occur at the same frequency. Is there a four by four magic square of cubes containing eight? Here is a seven by seven one. All of the rows, all of the columns, all of the diagonals, they all add up to the same total. And it even contains eight right here, two cubed. Every single one of these numbers is cubed. So we know a three by three magic square of cubes is impossible, but we have no idea if a four by four exists or if it contains eight. But if you find one, there is a 1000 euro prize for anyone who can get one with or without eight. This one is wild. Is eight the maximum number of times a number can appear in Pascal's triangle. Other than one, of course, I hear you saying there's infinitely many ones. But other than that one, I mean, here's two threes, and it's been proven that infinitely many numbers appear twice, three, four, and six times, but we only know of one number which appears eight times. It's 3003. So if you know the choose function, 3003 choose 1 is the same as 78 choose 2, which is 15 choose 5 and 14 choose 6. So there's four of them and then it's reflected. So this number, 3003, appears eight times in Pascal's triangle. And that's the most we've ever found. We don't know if any number appears five, seven, nine or more times. Absolute mystery. So ultimately, remember, you do not need to be good at maths to enjoy it. Not even mathematicians have everything figured out, and that's the best part.